Hi guys, welcome back to diet set. Today is cold again, that's why I don't have so much energy. But anyway, hi, how are you guys? So, yeah, today I'm kind of doing a new video where I'll be talking a lot because I have six perfumes to talk about, but I already did videos for these perfumes. So, yeah. You can go check out any of my videos when you like any of the perfumes that I'm going to talk about. So as you read down below, today I'm talking about the perfumes I used for winter 2022-2023. Yeah. Winter 2022 going into 2023. Yeah. Okay. This part of the world or the hemisphere... We have winter, autumn winter starts around September and it ends around March. Yeah, I know the other side of hemisphere is June, July, where I come from actually. Zimbabwe, hi. So, um, <clears throat> where should I begin? So, I'm going to begin with the perfumes that are actually still there you know like there's something still in the bottle then i'm going to go in the empties then i'm going to go in the samples so yeah it's kind of new this video yeah i thought since people ask me all the time i don't like i do not like telling people the perfumes that i'm spraying at the moment because i don't want you to to have a scent like mine so since winter is over, I'm not doing this, okay? So first, we are go. Uh, first, I talked about this lava dose diesel. I think it had an eight point five. I gave it an eight point five. I like the bottle; it's so cute. This is a sweet floral perfume. I think it's okay. I don't like its projection. It doesn't project that well. It's like I'm the only one smelling it. Otherwise, this is a good perfume. It's also, it came out like in 2011 or so. Yeah, it's like more than 10 years. It's, it's, you can watch my video. So it's always on discounts. I got this around the Christmas time and it was like 30 euros for 50 mils. Okay, that's around $30 for. 50 mils and i'm like it's yeah it's affordable because it came out such a long time ago it's a, it's always on discount most of the time i love this lava dust diesel the next one i'm going to talk about this was my last video so i think it's still new in your heads one for my favorite perfume brand Givenchy. irresistible this is a rose musky per, per, perfume. I love this perfume, although it's not that long lasting. It lasts, but it's not that, <clears throat> you know. I feel this perfume is great for all year, any weather. You know what I mean? I'm going to actually spray this in summer. I'm going to continue spraying it in spring, summer to see how it performs. I gave this an 8.2 if I remember. Yeah, I love it. I love the bottle. Givenchy, 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 whatever suits your ears is my favorite perfume brand. I think you know that by now. And yeah. I have another Givenchy, the London Dits. Yeah, I hope I pronounced that correct. I'm not French. I'm sorry. Givenchy is a French fashion brand. It's a designer, French designer brand. So this is a white, it's a flo yeah, white floral. This, and this is long lasting like crazy. Okay, when it comes to my clothes, it lasts like two days. 
I can still smell it. This is a very long lasting perfume. It costs a little bit. Yeah, because it's a good perfume. It lasts well. This is a really strong winter perfume. It's a floral perfume for winter. And because of its long lasting, yeah, it's going to cost a bit of coin. And yeah, the video is coming out. I think it will be the next video coming out. So I'm not going to talk a lot about this so that you watch my next video. But I love this. And yeah, to the next video, I'll be talking about this. So those are the remaining winter perfumes that I have. Because the other ones are now empties. So let's talk about the empties. My favorite perfume for 2022, you know. Okay, before I start. When a perfume finishes, please throw the bottle away. There is no point keeping the bottle. I keep it to make videos for you guys. Once I'm done with the videos, I throw the empties away, okay? Don't keep trash. In your house it's now trash when it doesn't have anything inside okay so my favorite perfume for 2022 as you know was midnight rose and it, this is a fruity floral perfume uh, i i love this perfume it's unfortunate i'm never going to spray this again because i don't repeat perfumes there are thousands of perfumes out there that i need to try and obviously i'm not going to try them all because yeah my life lifespan is not that long i guess but so because of that because i want to try as much perfumes as possible i cannot rebuy perfumes okay this it, it, it's in the hall of fame for my favorite perfumes i love this perfume it makes me crazy i gave it a 9.6 try it out guys this is a really good winter perfume we have the i, I talked a lot about this perfume <laughs> it's actually now an empty amani c eau de parfum this is um vanilla perfume although when you research about it some say it's a woody perfume but me i just smell the vanilla. really classy rich anti vanilla perfume you know what i mean and i loved the bottle it was simple it was classy and sophisticated like a rich anti with the gold rims going on over here i i loved the whole vibe it was giving like you know less is more when it comes to the bottle and i love it i love it you can check out the video i think i gave it a 9.2 it's now going to trash and we have the queen of masky perfumes narcisco rodriguez for her eau de toilette this is an eau de toilette but it performs like an eau de parfum you guys oh my god it's unfortunate i'm never going to spray this again because like i said i do not repeat perfumes this was a this is a really classy perfume you can spray it all year round although i discourage i discourage people smell <laughs> using the same perfume january to december because for example if you have a partner and your partner is scared to tell you that they do not like this perf this certain perfume imagine the torture you are giving them so mix it up a little bit give your nose a break give the people you are living with their nose a break please be tech so yeah i'm going to talk about the samples that i sprayed this winter that was the yugo bosa live or the perfum and am i going to buy the bottle no i am not i it it didn't wow me to that extent so i'm not going to buy it i, I don't have a lot to talk about it you can check out the video i did a video i'm up there it appeared up there somewhere and i also had a sample of jean paul Gaultier. 
<laughs> uh, the La Belle Le Parfum. I love this perfume. I love this bottle. It's on my wish list. When I'm, am I going to get this? I don't know. I have a system. And maybe I'll do a video one day. So, yeah, that was it for me this winter, you guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Till next time. Bye. And keep smelling nice. If you have sprayed or tried one of the perfumes I talked about, you can leave a comment below of how you feel about them. How was the experience for you? Yeah, this is a perfume community. So, yeah, let's share. Ciao, you guys. Bye.